Hello friends, it's Reza. Welcome to channel Reza Blade and thank you for joining me today for my Geek Girls collab series tutorial. I do a collab with Miss Nerdy Creations every couple of weeks and we have some geeky topics. Today we're doing back to school aka math and science STEM school. So uh, without any further hesitation, let us uh, do my really easy mani for today. I only did three nails because it's just straightforward stamping. I've already got a coat of my, now this is discontinued, this is why I hate <laughs> hearing names of polishes that I can never get again. Okay, so this one's called Green Thumb. I hope that it's available on, I mean, it's my, it's my favorite. If you guys find it, can you share it in the comments? Because I've looked around for this guy. Um, I, I would like a replacement bottle, but anyway it's really impossible to find it's been discontinued for a while anyway so I used three count them three uh, plates today I did uh, Born Pretty's BPL 064 and I've got Lena's hipster geek or chic 01 Which is pretty awesome and then I've got the paper design from stay weird BM P 109 that's a bundle monster plate so the first thing I'm gonna do is I need the paper to appear like it's behind an image that's gonna go on top of it so instead of in white I'm gonna do this in gray and with this green background, it works just fine. So let me show you what I'm doing here. So we get a stamping image. We've got it. And then get it on that middle finger there. I've used big, big nails for this. So you, they may be a little bit big for the stamp, but we've got that stamped right there. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is in white stamping polish, I'm gonna do the image that goes on top of that. So what we're looking for is this little nerd atom right here okay so let's go to my z joy white polish okay that didn't turn out with all the stamp so i'm going to use a i'm going to use a different scraper I'll use one of my Born Pretty really flimsy scrapers that I love so much. And I'm going to clear off my plate with a little bit of acetone. All right, now let's get to this. Let's, come on, nerd, take it. Take the stamp. All right, so we've got this just fine now. At least at first glance, it's just fine. So this goes on top of here. Oh no! Well, <laughs> what a cluster bomb. Okay, so I'm going to try to pull this off with tape, but remember I've got another stamp under there, so I'm gonna pull off some of the other stamp too. This is great. All right. Well, I'm just gonna use one of my others. That's fabulous. Okay. So let me try this again. You guys know how that's supposed to look. So I'm not even 
bothered about it anymore. I'm not going to worry about it. Here's what it looks like finished. So you can see I've done it successfully at least once. I'm not selling a game I can't play. Anyway, so uh, the next couple of stamps we're going to do are going to be from here. So I've got some atoms right here in my Manny. I've got this in a smaller size nail so it does pick up the whole thing. Here it's not going to show you the whole stamp but you can see at least the gist of how it looks. And then some more very simple stamping in white. I really do love these flimsy stampers. Alrighty. So there is our Manny. Like I said, it's an easy one as long as you can get this thing down. Basically, if you spend too much time pulling the extras off of a stamp, you're going to want to wait and put a sticky base coat down before you try it. Before you try us. And let the sticky base coat dry enough so that it won't tear up the stamp just putting it down on wet polish. So there's a couple of ways that it's easy to screw up, but it's also easy to do if you keep the procedure in mind. So I appreciate you guys joining me today. Take a look at the Manny that I have finished. This is my back to school STEM Manny. I really appreciate you guys hanging out with me today. Uh, don't forget my giveaway at 555 subscribers. I am doing a giveaway and check me out on Instagram at Reza underscore blade for my daily uh, inspiration Manny's. Uh, definitely subscribe to my channel and give me a like. I hope you like this video. Well, I'll see you later.